My biggest advice that I could give you would be, actually, I'm going to give you two pieces. One is to quantify the value. Because when you say it's expensive, like expensive is so relative. If, they're, if a, an average client is worth to them like $2,000 or $5,000 or $10,000 or even $1,000, if you could save them, basically, if they have to spend $5,000, they only need five clients, even at one grand, to equate to pay for itself, right? So I'm always looking at, like, as a business owner, I'm always looking at the ROI. I want to know, am I going to get my return? Because otherwise it is expensive. If it's $100 and I don't get my return, it's expensive. If it's $5,000 and I make 10 grand, it's really inexpensive. I actually talk about this, again, in my new book. I'll make more money, help more people. But I'm very excited about it because I talk about how like, I hired a coach that I thought was expensive at first. But in the end, it cost me way less because it was finally a coach who got me results. Because the biggest expense to my business wasn't making money. And so when I finally hired a coach that actually made me money and I doubled and tripled and quadrupled my income, even though it cost me more dollars, it was way less expensive. So number one is quantifying the value. So what you need to do is ask the questions and dig as far as like, well, what is an average client worth to you? And how long does it take you to, let's say, maybe get that client if you're saying time is what's going to give them that? And how much time would be off your plate if you did do that? And then keep getting there, digging, digging, we're swimming to the like, the bottom of the ocean here to find out what's really going to drive them to say, okay, yeah, it's a no brainer and it's not expensive because this is going to get me five clients. So I'm actually going to triple my money. That's one. And the second thing I would, would give you is, um, is urgency to your offer. There's got to be a reason to buy now. There's got to be a reason. So if you're not giving a discount, if you don't give bonuses, if there's no reason to buy now, the reason most often will be not yet. And they'll always choose to think about it because they don't have a reason to buy now.